各位同事，我哋準備好。Colleagues, it's the appointed time. Please go back to your seats. We can commence the meeting at 2:45 p.m. if we have a quorum. So again, it's an the appointed time, and we have a quorum. It's a call to order the meeting of finance committee. Today's meeting is supposed to end at 5:30 p.m., but because the five agenda items, including two public works projects and three staffing proposals, do not require further discussion, so I expect to complete these items at a relatively uh, short amount of time. I remind members that in accordance with Rule 83A of the Rules of Procedure, members should disclose the nature of any direct or indirect pecuniary interests relating to the items under discussion at the meeting before they speak on the items. I also draw members' attention to Rule 84 on voting in case of direct pecuniary interest regarding the two public works projects to be considered at today's meeting. I declare that I am an advisor for BOC Hong Kong. Now, first item is FCR 2023 to 2413. The item seeks approval of the recommendation of the Public Works Subcommittee made at its meeting held on 26th of April 2023, PWSC 2023 to 2447 NR Refuse Collection Point and Recycling Store Edge Site G5 Development of Anderson Road Quarry Site Saikong to be upgraded to Category A in money of the day prices. The estimated cost is $110.6 million. In accordance with paragraph 3A of the Finance Committee procedure, because the Public Works Subcommittee does not recommend further discussion, nor is there a request jointly made by not less than three committee members to further discuss the item, no further discussion is to be conducted by the committee as recommended by the subcommittee. I now put the item to vote, FCR 2023-24413. Will members in favour please raise your hands? For members who wish to vote against the item, please raise your hands. Well, none. I believe the members voted on the item. All of them are in favor of the item. I declare the item approved. Next, FCR 2023 2414. This item seeks approval of the recommendation of the Public Works Subcommittee made at its meeting held on 26th of April 2023, PDBSC 2023 to 24 5. That is to upgrade 71 GI the re redevelopment of Hong Kong Correctional Services Academy multi purpose gymnasium at 47 Tong Tao Wen Road, Stanley to category A in money of the day prices. The estimated cost is $437.6 million. Similar to the last item, as recommended by the subcommittee, the Finance Committee will not further discuss the item. So I now put FCR 2023-2414 to vote. Will members in favor please raise your hands? All right, members voting against the item, please raise your hands. Again, none. So I believe all members who voted on the item are in favor of the item. I declare the item approved. Next item, FCR 2023-2415. This item seeks approval of the recommendation of the establishment subcommittee made at its meeting held on 3rd of May 2023, EC 2023-24-1, creation of one permanent post of Assistant Director of Municipal Services D2 in the Leisure and Cultural Services Department to take forward the planning and implementation of the expanded and new portfolios and initiatives in arts and culture. Just like the two previous items, as recommended by the subcommittee, the co finance committee will not further discuss the item. Now I put the item to vote. I can see that Dr. Tixi Yun requires that a division be ordered. Now the division bell will ring for five minutes.
再開始表決，我再提一提佢哋嘅。好齊人啊！你睇下，我尋日已經話咗俾大家聽，有機會有記名表決啦。十五秒提下大家啦嚇，睇下何俊賢仲喺度 ，Stephen， 有阿強，大家準備翻自己。Now please be ready. Go back to your seats、uh, for the vote. All right, it's now time for voting. Before I declare the results, will members please verify your votes? Mr. Chen Yong, have you pressed the button? Yes, Mr. Cheng. All right, now I'll announce the results. For the 74 members here, 69 in favor, one have one is again voted against the item. Three abstained from voting. I declare the item approved. Now, item number four, FCR 2023-2416. This item seeks approval of the recommendation of the Establishment and Subcommittee made at its meeting held on 3rd of May 2023, EC 2023-242, creation of a new one rank rate and one permanent post of Commissioner for Industry, Innovation and Technology D4 and redeployment of one permanent post of Administrative Officer Staff Grade C D2 in the Innovation Technology and Industry Bureau to enhance the innovation and technology ecosystem and promote new industrialization as set out in the Hong Kong Innovation and Technology Development Blueprint. Similar to the three previous items, as recommended by the subcommittee, the Finance Committee will not further discuss the item. I now put FCR 2023-2416 to vote. Members voting in favor of the item, please raise your hands. All right. Will members who are voting against the item, please raise your hands. I can only see Dr. Tikchi Yun is against the item. I believe most members who have voted are in favor of the item and declare the item approved. Now, last item for the day. FCR 2023-2414, this item seeks approval of the recommendation of the Establishment Subcommittee made at its meeting held on 5th of May 2023, that is EC 2023-244, for the creation of one permanent post of Assistant Commissioner of Inland Revenue D2 in the Inland Revenue Department to enhance, uh, to be effective from the approval upon pr approval of the Finance Committee to in enhance capacity of the Inland Revenue Department to rise up to tax challenges arising from the evolving domestic and international tax landscapes with a view to enhancing Hong Kong's tax competitiveness and facilitating compliance with business taxation requirements. Just like the four previous items, as recommended by the subcommittee, the Finance Committee will not further discuss the item. I now put FCR 2023-2417 to vote. Members in favor of the item, please raise your hands. All right, thank you. Members who are against the item, please raise your hands. Again, only Dr. Tichian is against the item. I declare the item approved. Well, because the next Friday is a holiday, I would like to remind members that the next meeting of Finance Committee will be held on 2nd of June 2023. Thank you, everyone. This is the end of the meeting. Thank you.